how do I correlate these in any way to the other puzzle? There's some yellow leaves here, but that doesn't seem to be from you. My ability to actually interact with the environment is usually pretty limited outside of the uh, inputting of answers. Like It's actually a bit of a surprise that I can touch these, for example. So how do I make it a yellow bulb? There's a yellow bulb, but not in this room. Are there controls for the outside world? That'd be trippy, wouldn't it? And here's the two purple eyes, which is why it's, I put it as two, with... Let's see, what, were, what do I have so much for that? With line. Hmm. Can I find some more eyes? Oh, I could have counted the... You're probably supposed to count the tiles, at least if you can't figure it out based on the proportions of all the hallways. There was enough zigzags in the... Oh, it is glitching out. It wasn't doing that last time, was it? I feel like it wasn't freaking out like that the first time I looked at it. But yeah, because there was enough turning hallways everywhere, I could just tell how far each direction was. But that's why there's all these tiles to help you find that much. Uh, the maze clock's already on my list, right? Yeah. 2.35. And a broken chair. Which I guess means it's all the more silly that I came to the maze? I guess maybe I'm hoping... I don't know why I would, but I'm, I guess I'm kind of hoping to maybe find eyes. So I can put my back to the eyes and figure something out. That's funny. That's the same maze from earlier. It's the same one that's in the cave. The owl is even the owl is even underlined. That's funny. <clears throat> Shine light of truth upon their fat, false pamphlets and hidden letters. But did you hide letters in this thing, you bastard? I, I expect yeah. This should be where I'd insert the code, but not where I get the answer. Yeah, that's the only eyes I saw this whole time, until they gave me access to the cave. I don't know what to do with the glitching stuff. Wait. Three eyes. Punch. P-U-N-C-H. They do spell something eventually. Punch is the third eye. <clears throat> With punchline. With punchline? I'm glad to realize what those eyes are for. Go figure it was the eyes thing that I already knew about elsewhere. <laughs> Not very proud of the fact that I didn't draw that connection faster, I guess. With punchline. Now I need to find one eye. So specifically look out for one eye lying around. Do you have a second? Do you have one eye on the other side? Weird eyeless eel. Is that's why the bull and the cat and the eel don't have eyes. Because it would fuck things up. If anything else had an eye, it would ruin 
the eye puzzle, I see. Do I need the key to unlock the environmental controls? Oh man, do keys do really crazy shit when you get them? Maybe. Now I just need to like desperately search for one eye. Just one. Another key. I spy? <laughs> You're not supposed to be an eye, right? Like a bullseye? It seems a little tenuous. There's an apple up in that tree. Apple with punchline. No. I don't know how some of these leaves get in these places. Hmm. I think this might be a dead end for now. I swear I haven't seen an eye anywhere else. It might be helpful to think of what terrain has a bunch of like sticks lying around or things that could be a letter. This doesn't seem like the best. I don't think I fixated on this before. In fact, in the dark light of this room, I might have even seen it as white, but that line is white. All that text is green. Hmm. What do you have for green? On the wrong screen. Whoops. There we go. Lock. Red rose, gray mouse, yellow star, salt, door slash diamond tree. That's too many. Cause I'm wonder I'm wondering if we need to define an entire new set of numbers. So in the math room, everything was on a pedestal, right? So off the top of my head, I can say, let's see, maybe create a whole new area down here. We had tree and salt. It looks like here I might need at least four pedestals. Maybe five, like a five digit name. Hmm. It should be a reasonably quick sweep to check this. I don't remember every single green thing. Some of them were frames, but turns out we maybe should isolate those. <clears throat> so here's the green tree. There's a lot of frames, but we're deciding frames probably don't matter for this. There's salt on the green pedestal. Which I noticed really early. Now I need two more green pedestals. Which admittedly might even be in the math room. Let's check the math room, I guess. Nothing green. Like they avoided it specifically. So that's not going to give our answers for that. You're green, but you're not on a green pedestal. Okay, the drawer doesn't open. I just had this panic moment of like, wait, is this room got is this room full of drawers and never opened? Lots of green stools. This one's on a green stool, like it's a pedestal. 
So I'm a little unclear there, but I'm going to assume that's not it. This area should still have nothing in it, basically. Just the fact that it says red on nail, or that nail is red. Is red an answer somewhere? I was just here. Don't know if that counts as a pedestal, but it's not green either way. Hello. Nope, oh, there, there goes the controller again. It's really hard to switch to my keyboard without dropping it. Yeah. Well, it's not that hard. I just need to put it on the table <laughs> instead of my lap, where it just slides right off immediately. And by lap, I mean one of my legs. It's just not a flat object. At least I haven't used my PS4 for a while, so it has not been plugged in. So I, I set it up just for this game. And, uh... At least when I started the session, this controller wasn't... Let's try it. Let's just fucking unplug it. See, what, see if it sticks around for us or not. But, uh, when I first was trying to do stuff, I, I, it would not work. And if I unplugged it for a moment, it would power down. The trash bin still, still, still seems like a funny detail to me. Okay, so we have, we have three things. Three green pedestals found successfully. Globe could be the five. Is this a trick? Probably. Flower is way too many letters, so it's probably rose. Yeah. Because all the wall paintings look different than that. That's like a pedestal jammed onto a wall. Like, it's different from every other example. It's always stood out, but maybe now I finally have a reason why. I love that part of games like this, where every weird thing that doesn't quite make sense makes more- that keeps- you slowly put together why those things are the way they are star. There we go. Okay. So let's go back to the math equation. I went the wrong way. I can probably turn this stuff into that. <clears throat> okay, so globes on the bottom, right? Let's see. So, 84, 37, 58, 77, 35, 68, 36, 15. Okay, so these two things need to match. If I were to try to correlate these two things to each other, let's see. It's like the letters aren't even the same, right? Like, can you spell tree on this one? T, E. There's no R, right? So I think we're, I think it's new numbers. Well, if tree is on here, then tree is the one that ends with seven seven. Yeah, because it has two letters that are the, the same. And then what ends with an E? Rose. So rose is thirty seven, because it's the only one that ends with an E. So, S is 3. So, what starts with S? Salt. Both of them do. Salt and star. Okay. Uh, that's a bad example then. 
58, 77, 84, 37, 8. Okay. R. That's tree shit. Uh. Okay, no, it ends with R. Star. Star salt. <clears throat> R, 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 yep. Lost my mouse. There it is. Okay, so R is eight. O is four. S is three. E is seven. What's five? T. R. E. E. We have those down. S. We have down. S. T. A. R. We have all those. Okay. Salt. A. Wait, do I not have A down? I don't have A down. Okay, so six is A. We have STR though. STR, yep. L is one. And T is five. Yeah, we have that. Okay, so I need shot. S O T. I need H. I need H and globe. Doesn't have H in it. There's no H. But we have G. So what was that number I added up earlier? G. So 2 is when all these numbers are added together. So G is 2. G L O B. Okay. B is 9. If B is 9, then H has to be O. Has to be zero. So then, shot is three zero four five. Three. Zero, four, five, right? Really give them a shot. Um... Maybe I'm having troubles imagining it upside down. Shot. No, no, sorry, not. I wrote shot in this vortex flipper. Uh, 3045. Shoe. Okay. It's not one of the greatest hits, I guess. So I was having trouble flipping it over in my mind. I'm like, what is the fuck does that say? Admittedly, the four is tenuous, right? As H? I've never, I don't remember four becoming H. That's weird. But I'll take shoe. That probably is the thing. Da 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 set of codes, but I, I thought they were work in progress with no solutions installed. But you've solved two of them already, and uh, they, 
They must have been completed dynamically by the AI. The permissions should not allow that. But, I mean, the software is clearly broken, and, and at this point, all bets are off. So, maybe I completed the program after, after, uh, well, uh, anyways, how are you holding up in all this? Uh, it really is a wonder you've stuck with me this far. I'm stuck with you so hard. Okay, so, with punchline. What do I do with a with punchline? R2 with punchline. So here's our one eye. Where, what does it mean? Do I look out there? What's going on? You punks, you didn't even give me a key. Oh. Ends. I didn't see that at first. Ends. Ends with punchline. What do I do with that? Ends with punchline. Was there a joke? I used to leave my life. Where am I? Okay, here. Yes. Oh, wait. Ends with punchline. It's a joke. <laughs> I even said it. And then I didn't really register, like, oh, wait, that's a four letter word. That is the. That's what they mean. I was coming back here looking for a clue. Like, I hadn't solved it yet. But no, I just typed joke. Now we get a key. A silver I've key. To reset the simulation in excess of 100,000 times. Data breach to break through, but it's data breach secured. If I route it backward, data breach secure. Data. I've got it now. Okay, I've managed to trigger a security lockdown. That should prevent the AI from resetting the simulation. If that happens, I lose everything. I'm feeling stronger now, more alive. I can view the system code from where I'm at, and I'm working on a plan. <laughs> so it's a little funny at least being trapped in a world of your own creation with only a half-witted version of your own voice to keep you company <laughs> it's kind of poetic in a way but I never did take much to poetry only the correct settings will work How do I modify the settings? No music, three sun, three water, right? Yellow flower. What do I... <laughs> I used the key, what do I do? Cat, help me. Cat. Cat. I review the document? So only some of them give me gold keys to proceed with whatever's going on here, which made this blue. Sup. 
Uh, טוב. Are you up there? It's kind of pretty, but why does it feel like something's moving? Four purples, four purples. Still don't know what the deal is with these. Is it the answer to something? To what, though? And then there's the damn chess boards. I could have unlocked that. But I wanted to do the seed thing. Because it seemed like it'd be the easy one, but what's its deal? No music, three water, three sun, right? Yellow plant. Other than that, what clues do I have here? This chess? Do I figure out the order in which the chess boards happen? Maybe? I guess it would make sense that the chess boards are probably... Are there four of them? There's one in the maze, one in the main room, one here. And one upstairs, right? Rook? Is that the, the clue? Maybe each defeated thing is a sequence? Are the floor tiles a clue? I'm not sure how they could be, they're just here. I believe those are all the chessboard locations. I liked the I I liked the perspective little puzzles with the eyes. So now I'm a little sad by the implication that they I'm, I might be done with them. I kind of wanted to keep doing them. Pawn. Hmm. So I feel like there might be more than one recently taken piece each time. Upstairs is night. Check the maze. I think it's just these four boards. I don't think any of the boards are in a chamber, right? It looks like a queen. Yeah, because that's a king with the cross. Guess I'll just ignore all of those. Because they fuck up my whole theory. Queen, pawn, rook, knight. But that's... Let's see. A knight could be an L. But everything else is not very useful. Q, P, K, R. There's no vowels, so it's not a word. How would I turn those into some kind of answer? It's probably for the game room because it's a board game, but that's the best I have going on. Queen, pawn, knight, rook. There's no chessboard in here. There's a chessboard here, I guess. But not... Presumably not interactive? Yeah. Shut up, PlayStation. Fix your shit, boy. Queen, Pawn, Knight, Rook. Do any of those have alternate names? Castle? That doesn't help. Pawn, Knight, Queen are pretty consistent, I believe. We solved that. 
This is the clock thing that I don't know what to do with. Next in line. 